What it do, what it do, what it do, you tube. You see we're over here outside, man, and I'm about to enter in on some raffles at the local shoe palace, if you can see it right there, for these Jordan 1 Palominos, man. And hopefully we hit. Hopefully we hit. Let me show you all the whip real quick, though. It's changed up since y'all last saw her. So as you can see, we went and put some wheels on this thing, man. And she's looking delectable. Shining bright in the sun. Looking good, man. Let's go and enter the shoe palace, man, and see what they got in store for us today. First shoe palace, so they're doing a grand opening on the 19th, man. Shoe palace right here in Meadows Mall, the upstairs one, man. So we're gonna come back on the 19th for that grand opening. She said first come, first serve on everything. So we're gonna find out. I'm gonna hit the second shoe palace they got in the raffle over there. All right, y'all. Enter that second shoe palace. About to take myself to Chic, see if they got an in store raffle. I can scan real quick on that QR code. Stay tuned. because y'all can see and they had the black toe low sitting man and i can stay at those prices for long y'all heard it here first man so we got two stores knocked down i got about four more shoe palaces to go see man went ahead and copped a few pairs actually ended up hitting on five pairs man hit one from cs crs vr hit one from chic as y'all saw man hit one on end clothing sweet 160 man so sorry hit, ended up hitting on four pairs man Excellent, excellent, excellent. Shoe Palace didn't call it all, man. Hit a couple Shoe Palace stores, as y'all also saw, and didn't hit any of those, man. But did end up hitting, like I said, on CRSV, man. Shout out to them. It's a sneaker boutique in Cosmopolitan Hotel and Casino out here in Las Vegas. And they went ahead and blessed your boy up with these Air Jordan 1 Palominos, y'all. Y'all see it, man. Ended up getting this one in a size 11 and a half, man. Super, super hyped up, man. The packaging on this thing is delectable, as I've been saying, man. Got that nice black and gold. Super, super clean, man. Box is a little dinged up, but that's not going to take away from the shoe. Y'all see that nice gold on there. But going around the shoe, man, with that colorway off to y'all. So is this, it is in a size 11 and a half. Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Black Metallic Gold Palomino, man. Super, super dope, man. These did drop yesterday on the 2nd of September. Let me know in the comment section down below if y'all ended up hitting. They were sitting on the sneakers app for like 10 minutes-ish after the initial drop, so people definitely had time to snag up their pairs. I did see a lot of W's, man, so congrats to everybody that did hit. And also, let me know if you think this is the Air Jordan 1 of the year. Is that going to outshine the UNC toes? Or are the Palomino ones gonna be the ones, you know? But opening up the packaging, man, super, super dope, man. Right there, read it and weep. The Air Jordan 1 Palominos, man. Super, super fire, fam. Super fire, man. Got that fresh, brand new smell out the box, man. Boy, I think smelling super, super good. But check them out, man. The Air Jordan 1 Palomino, man. In that bread color blocking, man. Got that black and then got that Palomino, man. Looking super, super clean. The quality of the shoe is your normal decent quality. Nothing too crazy when it comes to it, man. Doesn't have nothing crazy tumbled leather. Does have that nice Palomino going around the back. They're calling these the Mocha 2.0s. 
and I can see it. I can see it. It's that bread colorway though that's kind of killing these shoes, man. Retail on these things aren't anything crazy. I think it'll sit at that price for a little bit. It will eventually go up, but I'm gonna guess by next year. Um, going inside the shoe though, got that gold Nike Air on the inside. Got a Palomino swoosh, Palomino on the toe box, and on the back heel, man. Like I said, it has that bread color blocking. You got Palomino at the very bottom of the shoe as well. Super, super clean. Let me know what y'all prefer. Go for the Palomino color blocking or the Chicago color blocking, man, because those are two separate ones. I feel like if it had like, or the, I'm sorry, the toe, the black toe color blocked as well. That's what the UNC toes got. Those look fire. That's what the Mocha's got. Those look fire. But the bread color, I feel like there's just too much black on there. That's just me personally. I think the UNC toes are going to outshine the Palominos. I like the UNC toes better. Those are probably going to be my first pick. But these are not to be slept on either, man. Got that gold on the Nike Air tab as well, man. Retail was 180 bucks on these things, like I said, man. Got that sale over here on the mid sole. Should have snagged a pair. If y'all didn't snag a pair, they're still going for right around retail. So nothing too, too crazy. You're still able to cop these things, man. Super, super excited. Don't forget, y'all, we have Sneakers Day coming up on the 9th, man. I'm going to do another video on that because it's going to be some real bangers, some real treats up in there, man. It's going to be super hard to snack some pairs. Get ready to take some L's, man. But it is what it is, man. Other than that, man, I'm going to hit y'all with this quick up close and personal look on these Air Jordan 1 Palominos, man. It's been your boy, Lil Schmack, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.